Hello and welcome back to Clannad. So uh, this is where we left off on April 18th, Friday, in-game. And so I guess we are just going to jump right back into it. I feel the sting of the morning sunlight in my eyes. Ah, uh, why did I wake up this early? I have enough time to make it to first period. It's not that I don't want to be late. I get up and put on my clothes. I make my way to the living room, stepping over my snoring father's body. The scenery looks different. I can see plenty of students that go to the same school as I do. Well, this is pretty normal. Hiya. Good morning! Hiya. Morning! I'm standing nearby as the stream of students continue to greet each other. There is no one for me to greet. Nobody at all. All of them are just passing by me, smiling. I'm sure no one even notices I'm there. That's why I decided to go elsewhere. It's not like anybody is going to call out and stop me. I'll be late then. Where are you going? Someone has tugged at me. Seems like a familiar person. She's a friend, just like me. A resident of this transparent world. Okazaki-san, Okazaki the school is this way. That's right, my mistake. How can you make a mistake? Everyone's going this way. That just makes me want to go the other way. No, you finally got here without being late. So, let's go together. Within this crowd, walking side by side with this girl. It's a situation that makes me shiver, just thinking about it. You go on ahead without me. I can't do that. If you don't go, I'll stay here with you. You'll be late. I don't mind. I stand still, watching the number of students going, uh, by decrease. We're running late. We'll make it if we leave now. I see. Hi. I don't get it. Why do you, or don't you know that I'm a delinquent? Haven't you noticed that no one ever waits for me? Isn't this a situation where you should worry that someone might see, might see you with me? I'm sorry, I'm getting all emotional already. <laughs> Let's hurry. Hi. I am so sorry about getting so emotional. This is a really, really emotional game for me. In the middle of the slope, there is the there is a girl staring at the sky. Her face is familiar, so I stop without a thought. どうしましたか、岡崎さん。is something wrong, Okazaki-san? Is she your friend? No, not really. Let's go. And we're back in the classroom, and then class ends. And I'm guessing it's lunch. Yeah. It's noon. We're at the usual place, eating our bread. Will anybody come after two weeks? In two weeks, the drama club will have a presentation. But it's the Big Dongle family poster. I'm at a loss for words. Okazaki-san? Well, it'll be alright. I believe that every single one of the dongle you released is sticking on every bulletin board and doing their best. ですよね。百人もいるんですから。I guess so, and there's a hundred of them. Well, I think that we'd be, er, that would be holding them down. Furukawa says that, full, full of confidence, as I fall silent. But why did that become, uh, meh? I cannot read tonight. But why did that, I think it's supposed to become, instead of became, uh, become popular? 
I keep thinking about it, but it's still a mystery. It really puzzles me why she liked it up till now. So, Okazaki-san. By the way, Okazaki-san. What is it? For the meeting, what should I say? Okazaki-san? I forgot. She's not the kind of person who can handle such things with ease. Furukawa. Hi. Let's practice it now. Say whatever comes to mind. I sit on the ground, waiting for Furukawa, who is sitting in, in front of the blackboard, to say something. She stands there as if, con as if she's conscious that she's uh, the club president. If we'd done this earlier, she might have asked me to do it instead. She seems to be looking straight ahead and doing her best now. That's the spirit. Hang in there, Furukawa. I'll be cheering for you. But... <laughs> With her hands moving all around and her eyes looking everywhere, she couldn't even start talking. And then, the bell rang. Oh. Hey, Furukawa. Hi. Why are you reforming the drama club? She kept her mouth closed after giving in to only this amount of pressure. If they found out that the club president is like this, the students who will visit would definitely leave. We're still searching for interested students, and there, there are two obstacles in our way. First, the Big Dongo family. Second, a club president who's afraid to speak. <sighs> no one would be able to overcome such a barrier. Rather, I don't want to overcome it. Ano, Okazaki -san? I'll be honest, Furukawa. Hi. You don't seem to have a knack for speeches. Uh? That's why you have to try very hard. Uh, hi. You'll have to practice now, or you have to practice how to make a speech for a while. Alright, I'll do my best. If you only have the will to try, you can easily do it. Ah, Tomoya! Oh no, it's Kyo. Hmm? Yo. Where did you go? Nowhere worth mentioning. Could it be this? She raises her little finger and grins. It's nothing sexual like that. Are you tired? Surprisingly, I seem to be or I seem to be quite a caring and considerate guy. <laughs> huh? Is this where I'm supposed to laugh? Sure, go ahead. <laughs> Quit laughing! <laughs> what? You tell me to laugh and then get angry when I do? You sure have some problems. Slide. Oh, I guess. Oh, welcome back. Huh? You're in class. Nice greeting. That's like saying I shouldn't be here. Well, you shouldn't be, right? You're an eyesore. Oh. You just increase the amount of waste carbon dioxide in the world, don't you? Even weeds are better because they produce oxygen. <laughs> what a horrible thing to say! Wait a minute, Fujibayashi Kyo, what are you doing here? What, are you saying I'm not allowed to be here? えっと、えっと、もう余礼もなったし、自分のクラスに戻った方が良ろしいかと。No, um, well, that's not what I meant. Um, 
The bell rang, so I thought you might be heading back. Honley wa mada de show. Mimichi koto itte ruto, hito to shite no utsuwa ga shireru wa yo. The final bell hasn't rung yet, though, has it? Saying something that stupid shows what kind of guy you really are. Bo. Bo. Mimichi desu ka? What do you mean, stupid? Mijin ko nami janai? Aren't you about the level of a water flea? Plankton! I'm a plankton! Hey, water flea, what's happening there? Eh, are you? Say what? I actually replied to that. Never mind that, just answer the question. Everyone seems to be crowding around that seat over there. There? Oh, that's our class rep seat. Fujibayashi seat? Did we have something we had to hand in? Ah, kito are ne. I bet it's her fortune telling. Fortune telling? Sore ni shite mo. Ai kawarazu no ninki ne. Wow, it's as popular as ever. What do you mean? Ryo no uranai. Ryo's fortune telling. Kito shite. Are you saying that our class rep is the center of that crowd? So. Yep. Is she really that good at telling fortunes? Hmm. <laughs> Although she doesn't look the type, I guess she does have something she's good at, huh? <laughs> and he gets it again. Ouch! What the hell are you doing? I won't forgive anyone who insults my sister. I was praising her! <laughs> Your grades suck, don't they? He failed every paper. How do you know that? I found the reports in your room when I rummaged through your desk. There was a massive pile of them and are at the back. Bo private or nine Don't I have any privacy at all? <laughs> You're worried about your privacy now after all this time? <laughs> I know, right? Both of you are not Oh, I just remembered. Hey, loser. Who are you calling a loser? Clearly you are, since you responded. She could have meant you. Nope, I was referring to you. Oh, really? Well, what do you want? Do you want to check out Ryo's fortune telling? As I almost... Accidentally said fortune cookie. <laughs> Tomoya already had his fortune read plenty of times. Hmm? Yeah, I suppose. Uh, so what kind of fortune telling are we talking about here? What kind? Well, it's... Uh... I'm gonna lie and tell him fortune telling using breath. Because then he'll actually go. Give me your ear for a second. Eh? What? Is or is it something nobody else should hear? Just get over here. Hmm? Eh? <laughs> Seriously? Ah, that person She's doing that in the middle of that crowd? And it's bear? Hold on, you've done it several times. Sunahara is staring at me wide-eyed. I smile and give him a thumbs up. Kyo, your sister is amazing. I thought I thought she was a quiet girl, but she's actually really daring. Tomoya, what did you say to him? Tomoya, what did you just tell him? Nothing. 
僕もちょっと占いしてもらってくるよ。あ、uh, go、ah, 手は洗ってからの方がいいかな。Should I wash my hands first?Nah, <laughs> you don't have to worry about that. Just grab like an eagle. 男らしいね。行ってくるよ。Oh no. The manly way to do it. Here I go. なんであいつ手をワキワキさせてんの Why is he flexing his hands? I lied to him and said that it's fortune telling using breasts, and it seems he actually took me seriously. <laughs> hey, what are you trying to do to,、uh, to Ryo? <laughs> <laughs> An old dictionary smashes into the back of Tsunahara's head. I have no idea where she got it from or when she threw it. She then shifts the focus of her anger towards me. Tomoya! Antane! Oh no. It was just a little joke. <laughs> you were lying? <laughs> Look who you're kidding with before you joke around. <laughs> Even if a kindergartner could,、uh, could figure it out, Yohei can't. <laughs> it crushes my spirit when you say things like that. Sorry, I should have known. If you apologize, that means you agree, which is even harder on me. Well, cheer up. Go get your fortune. Tell the truth, she only uses cards, though. Go on. You might even see,、uh, see some glimmer of hope in your remaining years. <laughs> you can't see any right now? <laughs> you thought of something? Oi, what's up with that face? Eh, that t e n e You see? Yeah. Chikso! Zeta s h o r i Oh my, I'm a big one, not the other guy! Damn it! Someday I'm gonna become way bigger than both of you! With that, he runs out of the room. Hey, where are you going? <laughs> I'm going to take a wee! <laughs> he really is below a kindergartner. だからさっきそう言ったでしょ Didn't I say so earlier? Anyway, your sister's fortune telling isn't accurate, is it? あわかった Oh, so you figured it out. Well, yeah. 本人には言っちゃダメだからね Just don't tell her, okay? I won't say a thing. ねえところでさ、あんたって誰か好きな子いんの By the way, Is this someone you like? Huh? Why are you asking that all of a sudden? なんとなく。Just wondering. Just wondering? ほら、不良ってさ、意味もなくかっこよく見えたりするらしいでしょ See, you're a delinquent, and you don't seem to know the meaning of being cool. だから大体彼女持ちじゃない So I'm saying, you probably don't have a girlfriend. How did she come up with that? You sure have some weird ideas. So, am I wrong? It wouldn't be、uh, someone from the school. Going out with a delinquent, that would certainly attract any teacher's attention. Could it be you're not going out with anyone because you're worried about that? Not really, no. It's just that I haven't found a girl I like. Even though we have found a girl we like, if you did, would you go out with her? Well, if you found a girl you liked, would you go out with her? It depends, I replied after some consideration. She asked me in such a. In, Such a matter of fact way, I felt compelled to respond in kind. Well, I have the right to choose to, that's why. My reply made her think for a bit. So, so、ね、yeah, that's true. 
来るもの拒まずなんてやつだったら惚れちゃった子の方がかわいそうだもんね。If a guy rejects a girl who's fallen in love with him, I definitely feel sorry for her. Crossing her arms, she agrees with herself. Why did you ask me that just now, though? Hm? Huh? Betsy? No reason. No reason at all. How about you, then? Huh? How about you? Do you have someone in mind? Ha ha ha! What are you doing? この私よ ?What are you saying? It's me you're talking about, you know? Yeah, so what about you? <笑> She smiles uncomfortably. Say something. まあ、いいじゃない、そんなこと。Well, okay. なんていうか、ほら、私がその気になれば、彼氏の一人や二人なんてボボーンとさ、ね。How should I say this? Well, If I wanted to, I could get a boyfriend or two, no problem, right? Don't give me that right crap. Trying to avoid the subject just means you don't have one. Nani yo, sono kawa. What's with that look on your face? No reason. Atashi wa anta to chigate, tsukura nai dake nan da kara ne. I'm different from you. It's just that I'm really not interested. Isho ni shinai de yo. We're totally different. Don't misunderstand me. I'm not interested either. Nah, mo! Ah, y e b a go you! Ah, jeez! Do you have a problem with that? The same goes for you. Yeah, I was gonna say that took a, a really long time for that bell to ring. <laughs> Everyone returns to their seats as the bell signals the beginning of afternoon lessons. Kyo also dashes out of the room. And class time. And it's over. Oi, again. Okazaki. Someone calls out to me before the end of the lesson. Since it, was, since it is the homeroom teacher, I ignore him. Didn't you hear me, Okazaki? You're persistent. What is it? I look at him dubiously. I make eye contact with him. Where's Sunahara? Sunahara? I look beside me. Sure enough, he isn't there. Who knows? Would you go look for him? Huh? Me? So, Omaeda Okazaki. Yeah, you, Okazaki. Why? I was thinking you might know where he is. I don't. So, ka. Nara. Omae o kawari ni yobu koto ni n a r z o In that case, you'll be called out instead. To where? もちろん、職員室だよ。To the staff room, of course. For what? お前は自分の遅刻の数を知ってるのか Don't you realize how many times you've been late to class? But I'm not as bad as Sunahara. I even came in early this morning. そういうの、五十歩百歩と言うんだぞ。There's no appreci-、eh, appreciable difference. とにかく、その原がいないんだったら、順番としてはお前になるんだよ。Anyway, if Sunahara's not here, then there'll be no other choice but to call you. <sighs> It's a depressing situation. But since I'm thinking of skipping class anyway, I might, it might be a good idea to actually go search for Sunahara. Okay, I'll go look for him then. I turn and start to walk away. Oi, Okazaki! Ima kara janai zo! Jugyo ga owatte kara da zo! Hey, Okazaki, I'm not saying right now. Do it after the lesson ends. I pretend to not hear him. With this, I won't be at fault for skipping class, and it's all thanks to our homeroom teacher. I'm sure Sunahara will be here during lunchtime, but I'm not sure I'll be able to attend fifth period because I'll be sleeping for the next hour. Maybe he'll appear and say, I've become someone big! I can't figure out where he might have gone at, or at all. It makes me lose my will to go find him. I'm getting tired of wandering around like this. I try to think of where he might be. I can't figure it out. Honestly, I don't care about Sunahara anymore. I'll go back. I remember something as I turn around. 
There should be a place in the old school building where I can take a nap. And that would be the first floor reference room. Eh, I guess. Since he is a delinquent and everything, and we should stay at least a little bit in character. This used to be the library until about three years ago. I heard from the seniors that it became too small as the school expanded. The teachers requested that the library be transferred to somewhere more spacious in another floor. As a result, this room became the reference room where they store un unfinished publications. There are a few students that come here because unpopular books end up being thrown away here, so it's always quiet. You'll easily fall asleep here since there is er yeah. You'll easily fall asleep here since it's so peaceful. I open the door and peek inside. Quiet as always. I always come here to skip class and sleep during my second year. Or I always came here. My bad. A desk and a and a bookshelf have been placed neatly in the corner of the room. I go inside and curl up in a corner by the window. I rest my back, using the chair as a pillow, and face the ceiling as I close my eyes. Ooh, I think this is one of my another one of my favorite parts. Uh, this is kind of a um, the beginning of a side story for another character, and this character I really like a lot. And then sleeping, I can hear the chime. It seems that class has ended. As the chime rings, it was accompanied by the sound of the door opening. I hear a little voice. Welcome! It seems I've made you wait. I opened my eyes. There she is! She's so adorable! And there's a girl standing right next to me. Huh? Me? Yes! Welcome! Uh, maybe I should be the one welcoming you. Do you need something? She's waiting for me to reply. She looks like a shop assistant. Some hot coffee. I place my order. Hi. Okay. She walks away energetically. Is she serious? I sit and wait for a while. She's so cute. I cannot get over how cute this character is. I love her in the anime. And I am going to try and see her full uh, character story throughout this series. I mean, at least I'm going to try. So hopefully we get to do that. Here you go. She places a steaming cup of hot coffee in front of me. It even has a teacup saucer. So I drink it. That's good. Thank you very much. She's still looking at me. Is she waiting for me to order something else? A plate of rice omelette. <laughs> Sorry, I don't have that. Damn, there's no rice omelette. Or omuraisu. Oh, uh, well, that's not unusual, since there isn't anything here you can use for cooking. Well, then, what else? Maybe... Then how about a haircut? <laughs> but leave the sideburns alone. <laughs> Excuse me, but what do you mean by that? I guess it's impossible. To begin with, it would be quite troublesome to clean the floor later if she cuts my hair. Well then, what next? Hmm. She's a girl. And we're in the reference room all alone. And here we are, a man and a woman. I guess that's the only choice left. With one single thought in my mind, I quietly move closer to her. And then I reach out for her hand. Shall we dance? <laughs> oh god, Tamoya. <laughs> Sure. I take her hand. <laughs> As if I could dance. So I quickly let go of her hand. Hi. <laughs> oh, 
Oh gosh, this scene was not in the anime, so this is actually quite cute. Ugh, I guess I'm making myself look li- uh, I guess I'm making a fool of myself. I'm such a novice. So you don't want to dance? I can't. That's a pity. Anyway, what's the matter with you? Suddenly talking to a strange guy like me and even giving me some coffee? Ah, Jikoshokai We haven't introduced each other yet. Watashi, Miyazawa Yukine to Imas. I'm Miyazawa Yukine. Yukine wa, Yushu no bi no yu ni, Nijuseki no ki. Sare ni, Tene no ne to kakimas. Yukine, as in you from Yushu no mi. Or perfect beauty. He from Niju no Seki, 20th century, and Ne from Taine, polite. Oh, really? Yoroshkereba, onamae okikase negaimasuka? Obaite okimasu no de. I spoke a little too soon. If it's alright with you, may I ask what your name, or what's your name? I won't forget it. You don't need to remember it. いえ、人の顔と名前を覚えるのは自信ありますので。No, I'm quite confident when it comes to remembering people's faces and names. これまでもたくさんの方のお名前覚えてきたんですよ。I've memorized plenty of names, even now. No, that's not really what I meant. But it's a pain in the ass to explain things one at a time. Okazaki. Shitawa? Ah, and your first name? Do I have to tell you that too? お願いします。Yes, yeah, please. Tomoya. ありがとうございます。Thank you very much. Ebisu Tomoya-san ですね. <laughs> Ebisu Tomoya-san, right? Wrong. Hi. Oh? I thought you were good with names, but you forgot my last name three seconds after hearing it. Ah, すみません. Ebisu-san-wa... Sorry, I must have confused you with Ebisan. Eto. Well, Okazaki. Thank you very much. Okazaki Tomoya-san. Torina, sen no kasabuta o motsu otoko. Dei desu ka? Okazaki Tomoya-san, is it okay if I call you the man who holds a thousand crusts? I guess my name isn't really all that, or isn't really that common. Ah, sorry,失礼しました. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I must have mixed your name up with someone else's again. There's someone else with such a popular name. Anyway, I think she's a little strange. But I guess she doesn't really care what other people think of her. And she's all by herself in such a lonely place. Uh, let's talk to her some more. Because like I said, I do want to get through her story. Because she is such an interesting character and her backstory is really, really interesting. Hey. Hi. You didn't answer my question after all this introduction. Hi. And what's that? Why would you talk to a person like me? Ah, すみません. Oh, I'm sorry. お邪魔でしたか? I'm not bothering you, am I? Not really. Well, isn't this the reference room? It might be that I was just searching for some old book. Oh. I, for some reason in this episode, I keep talking early. Oh, were you? Let me help you out. What kind of book are you looking for? I'm not really looking for anything in particular, though. Uh-huh. Really? Do you really like to fuss over me so much? ご迷惑でしたか? Am I bothering you? It's not that you're bugging me, but... Are you in charge of this place? 自分ではそのつもりです。I'd like to be. ここは昔は図書室だったんですよ? This was the library a long time ago. Yeah, I know. そうですか。Really? 
ここを図書室だと思ってるんです。I still think of this as the library. 私は、差し詰めこの第二図書室の図書委員といったところですね。Actually, I like to think of myself as the librarian of the second library. Really? はい。Yes, I do. In other words, this place was abandoned, leaving behind these ancient books and this odd girl. If I were looking for some interesting book, I'd have to come to her. Oh well. That's what this is all about. I can hear the bell chime. 授業ですね。Oh, the lesson is starting. Yeah. それでは。See you later then. She bows gracefully as she leaves the reference room. Oh, I muttered, or I muttered a voice. She stops and looks back. Hi. Thank you for the coffee. Hi. You're welcome. With a smile, she leaves the room. I, w- or I wonder since when sh- has she, eh,、ah, cannot talk today. I wonder since when has she been coming here. And this was the best place I could find to sleep in peace. Uh, let's sleep. I came here to sleep, so I'll sleep. Cause like I said, we should at least do a little bit of his, like, being in character. So we're going to. I lay down on the floor. It was a little cold, but I still fell, or, but still I fell asleep immediately. Sleep, sleeping, sleep. Waking up. And then I opened my eyes. How long have I, have I been sleeping here? I checked my watch. And it was already after class. Oh crap, I missed homeroom. I roused myself and stood up. And as I did that, I was greeted by the same girl again. Her name was Miyazawa, right? Good morning. Uh, yeah, good morning. There's no reason to hurry back. I relax on the chair as I stretch. Would you like some coffee? Yeah, please. She closes the book she was reading and stands up. She stands by the window and then goes to a shelf where the water heater is located. She pours hot water into the coffee filter. The wonderful smell of the coffee up permeates the room. That smell is really good. Here you go. She sets the hot cup of coffee onto a saucer, placing it before me. Thank you. I hold the cup in my hand and sip the hot coffee. It's delicious, as always. Don't say that, Tomoya san. You're embarrassing me. There's nothing to be embarrassed about. It's the truth. No, stop it! I'm embarrassed! Wait! Is she one of the bachelorettes that we can actually, like, uh, date in this game? Because if she is, I do not want to go this route. I really do not. <laughs> if that's the case, I'm so sorry, Miyazawa, but we wouldn't, I, I just wouldn't have, yeah, I just wouldn't really go through with your story because I don't want to date you. I just want to see your backstory in the actual game. So, yeah, the homerated kotoa, skunakata deskara, watashiwa. Since I'm not usually praised this often, she stands up, pretending not to be embarrassed as we look at each other. She then moves to the window, looking outside. Kyomo, e thank you desu yo, Tomoya san. It's a nice day today, Tomoya san. Nete iru dake nante, mottai nai desu yo. It's such a waste to sleep all, or to sleep all day. You really think so? Alright then, let's go out as though we've been doing this for some time. Hi! Yes, let's! Hey, as if I'd mimic a lover on a Sunday morning. Hi! This is the reference room, right? Hi, その通りです。Yes, of course it is. This place sure has become dreary. Anyway, that's not because of her. This place really doesn't suit you. It's just too... 
I finished my coffee. Thanks for the coffee. See you later, and sorry for bothering you. No problem. Please come by again sometime. Could it be that I'd actually be able to enjoy these dusty old books? Yeah, if I feel like it. That's all I had to say as I left the room. I have a feeling that she is a bachelorette that we can date in this game. And I don't know. I don't know if I really want to go through his story now. Uh, I guess we'll, I, we'll see. Sunahara isn't in the room, as always, when I come back. I'll leave it alone for now. I head to the drama club room by myself. Furukawa catches up with me on the way, and before I know it, we're walking side by side down the hallway. <laughs> Furukawa takes some eager yet amusing footsteps with me. Oh, we're going to practice now, okay? We're not going to practice acting, alright? We're going to practice your speech for the meeting. Okay. But still, even if we only brought in a single student, it'd make me nervous. Don't you think so? Not really. I don't know what you're talking about. Hey. Wouldn't it be great if you could really get your speech down? Yes. I'm good at memorizing things, so I think I'll be able to do it. But I won't be able to help you out with what you would be saying. I don't know what drama is all about, so I'm here to find out. Me too. Oh no. I just want to do a drama play, but actually, I don't know anything about it. The drama club president bombshell announcement. <laughs> hey, Furukawa. Hi. Why do you want to be in a drama play? Because I like it. Which part of it? I think it's fun seeing everyone's performances. I... I was always absent during school art festivals when I was little. That's why I thought to myself, I'll definitely join the drama club. And I'll do my best until my third year. But... But there wasn't any drama club during my first and second year. And I took a long break from school during my third year. Alright, that's enough. In short, her passion towards drama is because she admires people who do it. Putting everyone's strengths together in order to achieve one goal. And even now, she still wants to fulfill that unfulfilled dream. That's all. Tada. It's just that I like it. She lets out a small sigh, bringing both her hands to her chest. Just because of her speech, she seemed tired, being so frail and fleeting. Even still, she was able to do her best. I wonder if I could walk away after seeing her like that. If it were me, I couldn't. You passed. And that's why I told her that. Hi. Your speech just now was good. Even though it was short, well, you still managed to say the things you wanted to say the most. Are you trying to cheer me up? Not at all. I'm telling you the truth. I'm just saying what's on my mind. I guess so. I sometimes get immersed in what I'm er, in what I say. Yeah, that's why you should believe in your own words. There's just one small problem, though. What? 
That is, will you be able to say what you just said in the real speech? So ですね。Yes, you're right. You're not used to being put under pressure, are you? はい、弱いです。No, I'm not. My mind went into a loop again as I saw another problem. Why do you like drama? She did her best going over her speech after that. My answer is because everyone is doing their best. And also, I think it's great. Won't you work hard with us? That sums it all up. Though her words were a little childish, her eager speech is impressive. Question. I raised my hand, wearing my first year outfit. Hi, Dozo. Yes, go ahead. Um. We're gonna ask her what is that thing in your poster? What are those pictures on your poster? Someone will definitely ask that, so I can't ignore it. This is, the, this is the funniest part, I think. At least in the anime. It's the big Dango family! <laughs> She clearly answers at once. Do you mean that thing that was popular a long time ago? <laughs> yes, everyone in Japan would know how popular the big Dango family was. There's at least a hundred of them, and they're always having fun, so I'm a little envious. Though I think there's always a lot of trouble whenever they go to the park. But the Big Dango family. Stop! Hi? You suddenly became talkative. Well, is that bad? You have too many different kinds of tension. Sorry. That's good though. No, not really. I'm not saying the Big Dongo family isn't good, but that's not the point, right? Though you're the drama club president, I'll be lost to what you're trying to explain, right? You're right. My speech became all about the Big Dongo family. See what I mean? After all that, our practice continued for an hour. Furukawa's voice was beginning to wear out, so we, end the pra so we ended the practice. And then we left school. <laughs> and we walked home together. And just ahead on the road, I noticed a familiar guy. Tsunahara. What's he doing here now? Beside me is Furukawa. He's the only person I don't want to see while I'm with Furukawa. Uh, let's grab her hand and run away. About the hedges. Let's go, Furukawa. I grabbed hold of her hand and pulled her along. As I look behind me, I notice that something's wrong with Furukawa. She's on her knees. To put it another way, she's really tired. This is the worst case scenario. Students on their way home were watching us. It really makes me want to run ahead by myself. I'm sorry. Are you okay? I'd never do that though, so I gave her my hand as, as I asked her if she's alright. Yeah, it's nothing. I just got taken by surprise. Sorry about that. She held onto my hand as I helped her up. Is your knee okay? It's a, little, oops. <laughs> it's a little red, but it's not bleeding, so it's alright. Good. Helping people, how kind of you. An annoying voice. Tsunahara was standing right behind her. Let her treat us to something in return. He came over next to me. 
Sunahara is such a douchebag, okay? <laughs> Shut up, you go that way. Why is there a chance? This is a chance. Weren't you going to do that anyway? Well, it's, it's alright if it's just juice. She said that as we as she watched us whispering to one another. Oh no. What would you like? Is tea okay? How about some clear soda? It looks good. Are you a kid or something? Okay, sure. She seems happy to be able to treat others to drinks. Well, what about you, Okazaki-san? I'm fine. Okay. After I, after I replied, Furukawa headed over to the vending machine. Okazaki-san? Why does she know your name? Who knows? Hmm. Oh no. <laughs> she picks up the juice and runs back to us. Hi. Here it is. Ah, thank you. Great, thanks. He takes it and opens it immediately. Would you please just go away already? He started to drink. Well, I'm Furukawa Nagisa. Okazaki-san's always helping me out. Whoa. Furukawa started her one-sided greeting. You're Okazaki's friend, right? Well, when I was going to reform the drama club and he helped me with it. He's not a member though, since I'm the only member. And I'm the club president, too. She's actually telling him all that. Maji. Really? Yep, that's right. I became serious, too. I didn't see you yesterday after class, so this is what it meant. I hate that chuckle of his. And the drama club, huh? I'm surprised to know that you have any interest in club activities, even though you hate them. I thought you couldn't stomach club activities. Huh? Furukawa looked at me. I have a serious urge to hit Tsunahara here. But I couldn't touch him. That's why we were in the first place. First of all, we get along with everyone. Don't make such a scary face. Anyways, I'm full from the soda, so maybe I should be going. Throwing away the empty soda can, he walks away, satisfied. Okazaki-san? <sighs> About what you, about what that friend of yours said. She's worried about that, is she? Oh, well, I was in the basketball club in middle school. Oh no, he's gonna tell his little story about the basketball club. I'm not sure how far into the story he's gonna get. Um, at least in this part. But if it gets to like, um. The parts that I'm thinking of, I might start crying again. <laughs> I was a regular, but I got into a big fight with my old man just before a match in my first year. Yep, here he goes. Since I was injured, I wasn't able to play in matches. So I ended up quitting after that. Why the hell am I telling her about my past? Did I want to confess my unhappiness to Furukawa? Was I looking for pity? Then I'd like to help. Those were the words I was looking for. 
学校生活に希望を持てるように。Let's get you on track to being popular again. この、私のように。Just like me. She covered her face to hide her embarrassment. Is she trying to say it's all thanks to me? It seemed that her own good deeds came back to haunt me. Or my own good deeds, sorry. Though I really didn't want to open up the old scar again. My face is getting hot. I see. That would be cool. That's why I gaze up at the sky. I was watching the silver shining sky just above the roof, and I waited for the wind to cool me down. Three years ago, my school life was going smoothly as the captain of the basketball team. I even got a sports recommendation, and I was about to continue playing at high school. But that avenue was suddenly closed off. And it was all because of that fight with my old man. It began with a stupid quarrel about arranging my shoes as I entered the house. Our quarrel took a turn for the worse. And we just, er, and we got into a rumble. My right shoulder hit the wall really hard. Sorry guys. I am trying so hard not to cry, like actually bawling. <laughs> Although it really hurt, I managed to gather my strength and head to my room, closing the door behind me. But it was already too late when I finally saw the doctor. I was no longer able to raise my right arm. Never again. <sighs> Man! Oh my god! I am crying! <laughs> But this is where we're gonna end it because it is the next day. So, I'm a little bit surprised that、um, we didn't see anything from、uh, the. I guess the other world, the one with the, with the girl and the,、um, and the person that we are playing as. So, um, yeah. So I guess that's it for this episode. So if you did like the episode, please hit that thumbs up button down below. And if you haven't already, please subscribe because I will be continuing on with this series. Because obviously, like I've said multiple times during the series already, that this is a really, really、um, sensitive and it's, it's something that's really close to me. Something that I feel strongly about and for.、Uh, like I said in my previous video, if you want me to go into the details about why this,、uh, why this series is so close, To me, like it's, it's just close to my heart.、Um, if you really want to know why, just leave a comment down below telling me that's what you want. Because,、uh, like I said, I'm not going to go into that entire story with you here because that could take quite a while <laughs> and a lot of crying.、Um, so, I guess that's it. So, Bye, I'll see you guys in the next episode.